Boogly Wooglies, welcome back to Keanu's Luigi's Mansion Let's Plays. In the last episode, we were of course introduced to Luigi, and he made it to a uh, he made it to a mansion that he won in a contest he didn't even enter. And there, he he found a well, he found a key, and in order to and he unlocked a door. He got scared the shit scared shitless by a ghost. We also met Professor Egad. We came back to the lab, do some did some training on catching ghosts. We came to the gallery, and we managed to and we managed to capture the three. For the first three portrait ghosts of Area One, those being Lydia, um, those being Neville, Lydia, and Chauncey, and we also got a key for Area Two, and that's where we're gonna go right now. So let's go. So we're gonna go to the mansion. Okay, let's go. Here we go. Okay. So you see that door with those thorns up, with those thorny binds right there? Yeah, that's to area two. Yeah. <clears throat> okay. You put the key in. here oh bats oh yeah they're also bats in this game they're also bats in this game hello anybody here whoa a ceiling surprise ghost yeah these guys will come down from the ceiling and scare you but they're pretty easy they just they just take one they just take you just they, they have zero health HP, so you can just suck them up, no problem. Okay, I gotta check the Mario Wiki if, see if it's, it's right. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, it's a ceiling surprise. Just like the ceiling surprise, except except only this time it drops bombs when it when you when it comes down from the ceiling. Hello, anybody else here? Hello, hello. A gold a gold mouse. I got him! I got him! Yes! I got a gold mouse. Also, do you hear those sounds? They're coming from behind this door, but it's locked. It's locked, so we have to go in there. Damn it, it's locked. Another ceiling surprise ghost. Okay, let's check the let's check the, the Game Boy Horror. See if there's any doors that are unlocked. Ah, the wash, the bathroom. Hello? Whoa! It's a grabber ghost! These are actually my buddy Nathan's favorite ghosts. Yeah, these ghosts actually latch onto you. Oh! It's the professor! Hello? <laughs> Looks like you've run into a bit of trouble there. Maybe you need more training. There are some ghosts who will try to grab and hold you. When when that happens, try moving your control stick back and forth to shake them off. It's the age-old struggle for survival, my boy. Don't lose don't lose heart, Luigi. There's a key. There's a key up on that shelf. It's a good thing no one's in that shower. Is that? 
then there, then if there, good thing there was no no one in that bathtub, then someone would have been like, ah, a man, and stuff like that. Remember that in in cartoons. So this key is so this key we have is for this room right here. Oh, wrong button. Yeah, we could zoom in and use the C stick to. Yeah, so the key we have is for this is for this door right here. Oh, a bowler ghost! Yeah, the reason why it's called a bowler ghost is because it'll pull bowling balls out of your mouth and try to bowl you down like a bowling pin. Also, do you hear those piano tunes? That's for another portrait ghost we'll find later. Hello? Oh. <gasps> shy Guy Ghosts! Yeah, they have Shy Guy Ghosts in this game. And apparently, we can actually see what a Shy Guy looks like without his mask. See? You can actually see what they look like without their mask on. So in order to defeat the Shy Guy Ghost, you have to suck up their mask. You can actually see what they look like without their mask on. And just like real Shy Guys, they go... And stuff like that. the next portrait ghost we have to find, we have to catch. The Floating Whirlindas. Yeah, they're a dancing couple. I don't think this gent can even see us. Come on. I don't think this gent can even see us. It's a picture, but I can... So you can see me. Well, that may be, but you will never find my weakness. Yeah, the only way we could catch these guys is if we're only on the spinning on the rotating dance floor. We gotta wait till their heart, their heart shows. Aha! Got him! I got him! I got him! Come on, come to Papa! I got him! With one shot! First try. Also, I think that picture was one of the floating... I think that's a portrait of one of the Florida Orlandas. Okay, let's look him up. The floating Whirlindas, the dancing couple, unknown age. Once the local waltz champions, they can no longer compete since their feet don't touch the floor. Oh yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay, so this key is for this room right here. Hello? Anyone in here? The storage room. Hello? Ah! Purple Puncher! I got him, I got him! A speedy spirit! Oh, he got away. Oh no, it's a red grabber ghost. Ow! 
Get off of me. Come on, Big Red. Come on. Yeah. Hello, what's this? Don't push. I wonder what happens when I push it. Ah, <coughs> oh, it's another room. Well, that's some Scooby-Doo shit right there. Danger. The red button. I feel like I should touch that. I feel like maybe I should press this. Huh? What the hell? Bones! Who is there? Who dares deserve our sleep? Oh, it's Luigi. Look, guys, Luigi's finally here. We're gonna do what you did, you did to your brother. Only worse. What's the enemy back? It's these guys poking us. Everybody scram! Yeah, that thing, that thing was, that, that chamber was full of booze. Luigi, are you okay? That was them. Those were the ones who released all of the, all of the ghosts from the paintings in my gallery. Those fiends. I wonder where King Boo and his gang had gone, so they were hiding, they were hiding in the mansion all along. Thanks for flushing them out, Luigi. I'm tickled you found them. But perhaps it would have been better if we, if you hadn't. Well... Let me let every single one escape. Just a thought. Ah, oh, well, water under the bridge. Anyway, you should probably come back to the lab for a sec. For a sec. I've been wanting... I've been waiting for you, young Luigi. Your brother must have taken that by the that gang of booze, poor feller. Oh, now, don't talk crazy. You're, they're not gonna eat the man. But what came, became of him? But what became of him, hmm? Odd that he doesn't. Odd that he hasn't come back. Common theory holds that kid booze grow in strength when they when they travel in numbers. They must have somehow combined their powers. Combowers too. Their power likely overwhelmed your brother. If your aim is to save Mario, there's w one way to do it: capture each boo and slowly weaken the group's power. But boos, as their name implies, like to hide and then jump out. To scare people, you've got uh, you've got your work cut out for finding them. <laughs> Don't get all down in the mouth, my boy. That Game Boy Horror I gave you has a secret function. I knew it'd come in handy one day, so I developed it secretly. I call it the Boo Radar. The Boo Radar will flash red when something round like a boo is hidden nearby. Use it to search everywhere, Luigi. All right now, Sonny. Don't go talking yourself out. Relax. I'm just trying to get those boos at one at a time. The trick is using the control stick and the C stick together. Don't forget now. Where will you go, Luigi? The mansion. Careful now, Luigi. I gave Professor Egad a, a voice that sounds like Molto from the Zula Patrol. Or he sounds a lot like, yeah. I, I gave Professor Egad a voice that sounds like Molto from the Zula Patrol. Has anybody seen the Zula Patrol? You know, way, way up where the planets do the hula. Spin and shout till you find yourself on Zula. Let's take off. Now, if you guys have seen the show, you know what I'm talking about. But there's a boo here. See the, see the boo radar right there on the screen? I heard a, I heard a giggle. It's turned. It's it's yellow. That means a, there's a boo in here. Hmm. It's not in this in this nightstand. It's not in this armchair. It's in the bookcase. There it is. I am bamboo, if you please. Oh yeah, boos have different names. They're not all. They look alike, but they have different names. Bootsy, you've already caught your first boo. I've been researching those guys. Well, these boos don't seem to like like much, that's for sure. They do their best to hide in an under 
uh, in and under furniture when they're stuck in a lit room. Oh, yeah. So then, I reckon that means that turning on all the lights in the mansion is the fastest way to find all the boos. Wouldn't you say, youngster? Okay, now send me the boo and all the data you caught. Okay, once you caught, catch a boo, you can save. Be careful, Luigi. <clears throat> okay, there's another boo in here. I'm getting warmer. I think it's in that light. In that chandelier. When it blinks red, that means the ghost is in there. A boo is in there. Oh, ha, ha, ha. Very funny, boos. Sometimes there'll be a decoy in there. It's in that vase. There he is. Looking for me, Bootha. Outstanding work. You're like a leopard on the hunt. Okay, now send me the boo and get all the data and all the data you've got. Be careful, Luigi. Hmm. It's in the it's in this wardrobe. It's in this wardrobe. Wanna play Game Boo Advance? <laughs> Game Boo Advance? I get it. Game it's like Game Boy Advance. <laughs> well done, Luigi. Okay, now send me the boo and all the data you've got. Okay. Be careful, Luigi. Yeah, since since Professor Egad is a is a scientist and Molto from Zoo Patrol is a scientist as well, I thought I'd combine the two and give give Professor Egad a Molto voice. Okay. Let's check that cheese now. It's in the chair. Oh, a bomb! Speak about my name, Taboo. Yes! Isn't... It's like you were born to capture booze, Luigi. Okay, now send me the boo and all the data you've got. Be careful, Luigi. Okay, now let's go into Lydia's room. Maybe there's a boo in here. It's in the plant! No, wait. Is it, I think it's in the bed. Yeah, it's in the bed! Ah! Oh, it was a bomb. It's in the dresser drawer. It's in the drawer. Maybe it's on the makeup table. No. Uh, excuse me. It's in the bed. It's in the bed. I am the yummy delicious. Yeah, the boos look, may look alike, but they all have different names like Bamboo, Taboo, Game Boo Advance, Boolicious. Unbelievable! There's no stopping you, Luigi. Okay, now send me the boo and all the data you've got. You've already found five boos. You're a boo snoring ma snaring maniac. <coughs> I understand you're worried about your brother, young Louis, young feller, but take but take her easy. You have plenty of time still, so try to keep your shirt on. Why not go to why not go to the washroom and splash some water on your face? You'll feel much better. You believe you me. <coughs> Actually, I'll just I'll just work using the mirror. 
<clears throat> I'll just work using the mirror. Here we go. Whoa! Okay. Okay, so we have to go back in the washroom. Or we could catch some ghosts in the ballroom. Uh, oh, it's in these chairs! Hello, I am Bulala. Oh, I get it. It's like Ulala. I get it. I get it. It's like Ulala, but Bulala. Aren't you just loving my brilliant inventions? Okay, now send me the boo and all the data you've got. Yeah, he always says that. Okay. Okay, there's one in the storage room, too. Hmm. We're getting colder. Colder, 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 colder. Warmer, warmer, warmer. Ah, it's in the stack of chairs. Just call me Game Boo. Oh, I get it. It's like Game Boy. Ow, oh, he got away. It's in these crates. Ah, it's just a decoy. He went into the hallway. Come here, you. Gotcha. It's like you were born to capture Boo, Luigi. Now, okay, now send me the Boo and all the data you've got. Okay, got it. Yeah, he'll repeat this line every time you catch a Boo. Ah, purple bomber. Gotcha! Okay, check the GPS. <laughs> oh, you see that you see that floating candelabra? Well, fooled ya. It's not. This is the other port this is the next portrait ghost we have to find. This is the next portrait ghost we have to capture. This is Shakes. I mean this is Shivers, the butler. So this guy actually scared my buddy Nathan when he when he was a kid. This guy actually scared Nathan, my buddy Nathan, when he was a kid. Hey, I I uh, I dropped a really important thing into the toilet. I didn't mean to. Don't worry about it. Hey, you're right. No point in crying over spilt milk. I suppose I'll flush that old worry away. Yep, I'll just let it swirl on down to the depths and let happiness refill my life. Oh, a heart. I wonder what he means by, by important object. Yeah, I'll see. A key! So it's in that room. Ah. Okay, so it's for this room. Oh, hey, a mirror. Whoa! Oh no, it's a turquoise grabber ghost. Uh, get off! And these guys are invisible. They're only visible in that mirror. They're only visible in that mirror up there. See? So we have to capture these grabber ghosts. Gotcha! 
I got him, I got him, I got him! Ah. I got him, I got him! Got him! Oh, there's a boo in here. It's in that chest. Not... Oh! Oh, this also is an important item. This thing right here. <clears throat> it's the professor! Hello? Hey now, Luigi. Hey now, Luigi. What have you found there? Let's take a look at it. Oh! Ah, it's a fire element metal! Now you can use the fire element. Yes, sir, with that, you can catch el fire elemental ghosts. Hmm? What's a fire animal, animal ghost, you ask? Why, they show up whenever you see a fire, my boy. They're, they're ghosts of fire itself, if you will, if you will. If you approach a flame, they'll be surprised by your presence and leap out of, into, the, into the air. Then you vacuum them up right away. After that, you can expel fire with the L button. You can melt ice, light candles, and do all kinds of stuff. A, me a meter will appear down at the bottom of the screen, so keep an eye on it, on how much element you have. Okay, Beller? You may have to use the fire element to defeat some ghosts. Keep that in mind, Sonny. Don't say I never warned you. Okay, we got the fire element. Yeah, this is what the professor was talking about. So when you... <coughs> so when you see a fire source like this, then a fire ghost will appear and you can suck it in and you can... You can shoot... You can now shoot out fire. Feel the wrath of Kung Fu! Oh, I get it. It's like Kung Fu. Fantastic! Way to go, Luigi! It's like these candles. There we go. Also, this is also a key room. This is a very important room. A key! Yes! <clears throat> There's a key in there. Also, watch what happens when you shine this light onto this crystal ball. <clears throat> It's another ghost. <laughs> Guys, this is Madame Clairvoya. She's another one of the portrait ghosts, but she can tell you about uh, the items that you see, that you find. What do you seek of me? Who are you? I am Madame Clairvoya, see not seer of dropped items. Possessions of other power people awaken vibrations in my spirit. If you find someone's dropped item, you should bring them to me. I will show you the extent of my vision. Yeah, she's a ghost fortune teller. If you find an item, you can bring it to her, and she'll know what it what it is. <gasps> ah! Okay, let's unlock this room that, that this key goes to. Oh, bats! Okay, so this key unlocks this door. Hello? Ah! A purple puncher! Oh, it's a red grabber! Hello? <gasps> Another purple puncher! Ah. 
Gotcha! There's a boo in there. <clears throat> oh yeah. Some chests will just give you coins. And dollar bills and gold bars and stuff. It's in this cabinet. Oh, ha ha. Very funny. Hmm. It's in that bucket. Yeah, get down. I'm boogie. I don't like it. It's like boogie. Like boogie. Boogie down. Oh, you're on fire, Luigi. On fire. Oh yeah, this is the butler's room. Also, do you see that little mouse hole right there? Watch what happens when I scan it. Whoa! It's a hidden room. Yeah, it's a hidden room. Nope. Jackpot! It's a hidden room. A, it's a blue flurry! Okay, which, which, which one's this called again? It's one of the elemental ghosts. I know that. Uh, it's a... It's a... A flash ghost. Yeah. Yeah, it's weak against fire. It's an icy ghost that's weak against fire. Yeah. So for the elemental ghost, you have two ways of beating them. You can either do the opposite element that that to beat them, or you could just melt beat them with the element, then they're they'll be like normal ghosts. Yeah, watch. Like watch. Yeah, you gotta melt their ice with the fire. You gotta melt their ice with fire. Gotcha! <clears throat> oh. Wow! Oh, it's a ruby, a sapphire, and an emerald. A ruby? A sapphire, an emerald? And a sapphire. Gold bar! Ah. Hmm. We gotta be here somewhere. It's in this chest. I am, I, it's own, my own self, Gumbo. Oh, I get it, it's like gumbo, like, like the soup. You know, like, you know, gumbo, it's a soup. Unbelievable, there is no stopping you, Luigi. Okay. Like these candles here. So how do we get out of the sealed room, you may ask? Well, we take the same mouse hole. Like that. Whoa! Ugh. Oh, a little mouse. Okay. So now let's, now let's go to, sh yeah. I'll show you shivers. I'll show you Shivers, the butler. So in order to find him, you have to you have to light his candles. <clears throat> but let's scan him first. Ah, 
the beautiful melody will not even give me the time of day. What I, what must I do to win her? Passion! Yes, that's it. I will show her I burn for her. My unbridled passion will scorch her soul. Also, Luigi Fan Quadruple One actually did his own take on the Luigi's Mansion boss ghost voices. Yeah, when you light his torches, then shivers will become visible. This actually scared. This is the ghost that scared Nathan when he was when, my buddy Nathan when he when he when he was a kid. Yeah, so now we have to follow him to his room. Now we gotta follow him into his room. There he is! I got him! I got him! Yes! I got him! There's a boo in here somewhere. You found me, peekaboo! Oh, I get it, peekaboo. I get it. He's a boo, and his name is Peekaboo. Yeah, I know, Professor. Oh yeah, you, you can press the A button, and he says Mario. Okay, this this. Okay, this. Okay, so this room. So this key is for the. Uh. I got him. So we're. Oh, I might as well show you shivers. Shivers, the wandering butler, 72 years old. He wanders the house endlessly searching for his master's will. He hopes he's included in it. Who is the master? Who is Shivers' master? Is it Neville? Yeah, so this is where that piano music is coming from. This is the conservatory. Also, there's a it's a room full of instruments. Oh, this is another portrait ghost. Yeah. So in order to trigger this boss, you have to you have to trigger these instruments. So there's the sax, these horns. Also, listen closely. This harp. This this cello. This xylophone. Listen closely. It's the Super Mario Brothers song. beauty of the ivory keys. What a stirring performance. I haven't been so charmed by a piece of for ages. You must have a delicate ear for music. Would you like to listen to my piano sonata? Well, here I go. featured in a fa that song was featured in a famous game do you do you know which game i'll let you guys guess i'll give you guys 10 seconds to i'll give you guys 10 seconds to guess what game that that theme that she played was from
let me know in the comments if you know the let me know in the comments if you know the game. Time's up. Have you guys guessed yet? The answer is Super Mario Bros. 3. Exactly! Right! You got it! Very impressive. I guess I needn't hold back with you. Would you care to do a do battle with my lovely music sheets? Oh crap, she's got sheet music! So just suck him up! Ah. Yeah, she's a... Yeah, Melody here is a ghost pianist. That's piano player. Ow, I got hit with a poison mushroom. Yeah, when you when you get hit with the poison mushroom, you lose some of your coins and you can and you can no longer suck in and you can can't suck in enemies temporarily. Hold on, I gotta check the battery level. Oh. I think we have actually have time to get to finish area one. I mean, X area two. Oh. That's the door that leads to my one of my favorite boss ghosts. Oh, ha ha. Very funny, booze. Where, wherefore, I am Boomio. Oh yeah, I get it. It's like Romeo, except Boomio. I get it. Like Romeo and Juliet. Yeah, I know, Professor. Okay. Okay, so this. Okay, so this. So this key that we have. Well, oh, I better check. Check out. Check out. Check her out. Melody Pianissima, the beautiful pianist, 26 years old. Despite playing movable mel moving melodies, she has a surely disposition. Oddly enough, she loves video games. I do too. So, wah! Also, this is why it's called a bowler boast. Yeah, it sometimes roll. It sometimes it it tries to hit you with a purple bowling ball. I got him. And just like the ceiling surprise ghost and the purple bomber ghost, they just take one hit. Yeah, in here we'll find my favorite of the portrait ghosts. And you'll find out what's making that, that noise. That's him. That's this. This guy is my favorite uh, boss ghost in the game. No one can see me in this darkness. No one, no one, no one, no one. Yeah, this is my favorite boss ghost in the game. This is Mr. Lugs, the glutton. Yeah, he's pretty much a fat ass. He said he... Yeah, he... Many people say that he actually ate himself to death. But other people say he actually choked to death on a cor on a hot corned beef sandwich, on a mile high hor on a mile high corned beef sandwich. So what we gotta do is light up his candles. Ow! Oh yeah, we can slip on banana peels in here. So what we gotta do is suck up his food. What exactly is he eating? Is that scrambled eggs or? Pasta or whatever it is, whatever it is, he's eating it like a, well, you know, like a glutton. So what we gotta do is suck up his food with the vacuum. And sometimes, occasionally, these overworked ghost waiters will, will refill his food. So you, so what? So what? So you have to. So, but first, so 
when you suck up his food, the ghost waiters will refill his plate. Because, you know, he needs more food. He's like Audrey 2 from Little Shop of Horrors. He needs to keep eating. So when you suck up the food, these ghost waiters will come in and refill his plate. So so when you see a ghost waiter, you have to you have to you have to you have to suck him in so they won't refill his plate. Then you can suck up his food. Oh crap. Oh no, now he's mad! Whoa! Yeah, when, he, when you suck up all his food, he gets mad and he'll, he'll, he'll breathe fire. Whoa! Whoa! And you have to dodge his fireballs. Tired out, that's when you can suck him up. But since he's so fat, he's hard to he's hard to catch. Because you know he's so fat. Yeah, the reason why he's my favorite is because he, you know, he's kinda like me. I can be a little bit of a glutton myself. I like to eat. He's also kinda like my fictional daughter Valerie. Who also likes to eat, and she's also a bit fat. But she doesn't mind. She doesn't mind when someone calls her fat. Yeah, my do my my third fictional daughter, Valerie, doesn't mind being fat. Or being called fat, or any type of word that relating to that word, to the word fat. Got him! <clears throat> I got him! There's a cheese underneath that chair. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, let's just use this coin, bills, and gold bars, and a diamond. There's a boo in here somewhere. Name's Boodacious. Got it? Oh, I get it. It's like Bodacious, but except it's Boodacious. I get it. <clears throat> you gotta hunt him down. There he is! It's hard to catch a ghost when you're in a when you're in when you're in the hallways. There he is. I got him. Area two. And when I finish area two, we'll be we'll call it quits for the night. Hmm. Mario. Oh, yeah. Mario. I'm trying to move this chair. It's underneath that chair. It's the kitchen. Oh, those pots and pans are good. Are alive. Oh. Try to open the refrigerator. Ow! Oh, it's a it's a flash ghost. I got him! I got him! 
There's another boo in here. Whoa, that door's on fire. Oh, what's this? Hello? Hey now, Luigi. What what have, what have you stumbled what have you stumbled across? Oh this it's a water element metal. Now you can use the water element. My research shows that these particular element ghosts leave their watery dwellings whenever you approach. You know, you know the drill. Vacuum them up. Use the O button to expel. Once you they they, va they vacuum. It's, if you press the L button all the way in, you can shoot out a big ball of water. I, I hear where there are some ghosts who can be defeated only with water. Actually. Also remember that water has purified properties, so use it well. Don't get too caught with your new squirt gun, Luigi. Yeah, thanks, Professor. Yeah. Like, what he means is, just like the fire element, you can now shoot water. Hmm, where is he? He's in the refrigerator! Ah! It was a bomb. Where is he? Where is that boo? Here. Boy, howdy, I'm booed again. Oh, I get it. It's like cool again. Except it's cool again. A lot of these boo names are pretty. A lot of these boo names are pretty creative and pun and wonderful. Okay, what we gotta what we gotta do is we gotta put up this fire. Put up this flaming door with the water. Okay. Oh, I might as well show you Mr. Lugs. Mr. Lugs, the glutton, 30 years old. He prefers all-you-can-eat buffets to three-course meals a day. He eats to three meals a day. He prefers all-you-can-eat buffets to three meals a day. He ate himself to death, but still wasn't satisfied. Damn, it's like his stomach... It's like, it's like his stomach is an infinite black hole like Kirby. It's a flower. Also, do you see that in the doghouse? That's another portrait ghost. Yeah, this is Spooky, the guard, the, the hungry guard dog. Oh crap. Oh crap, he's awake! Hey, nice doggy! Nice doggy! Nice doggy! Ow! Get him off, get him off! Yeah, yeah, this is Spooky, the, the hungry guard dog. You're the love of dirt! Make that yappy dog be quiet! Oh yeah, this is another ghost. This is another ghost. This is Mr. Bones. He's a skeleton ghost. That's Mr. Bones. I got him! I got him! I got him! I got him! Ow! Bad dog. Nice doggy, nice doggy, good doggy! I got him, I got him! Good doggy! Good buffer whoppers! Okay, let's look him up. Spooky, the hungry guard dog, four years old, in ghost dog years. This creepy canine will sink its chops into any seemingly edible thing in sight. Also, you see that shiny thing in the in, in the you see that shiny thing in the, the in the doghouse? Watch what happens when I use the scanner. Whoa! Ugh. The graveyard. 
Yeah, this mansion has a graveyard, too. Whoa! Mr. Bones! Come here, Mr. Yeah, Mr. Bones, he's a skeleton... He's a, he's a skeleton ghost. Kind of like the Gush of Dope <clears throat> oh, this is where we'll find the big boss ghost. Oh. oh my god! Yes, this is the second boss ghost. This is Bogmire, the cemetery shadow. You might also know this guy from a Lego Mario set. Ah! Yeah, so this guy is pretty easy too. So what you gotta do is you gotta suck up you have to suck up these shadowy versions of Bogmire and and suck it and shoot it at the real Bogmire, which is right here. And then you get a chance to suck him in. But he's really hard. Check that! I got him! I got him! Yeah, he can actually make shadowy decoys of himself. And you have to shoot the shadow... You have to suck up the shadowy decoys and shoot him at the real Bogmire. The one that casts the shadow is, is the real one. Ow! There he is! He's right there! Ow! This guy's pretty easy. Yeah! Woohoo! <laughs> Not so scary now. Not so scary now, huh? Okay. Bogmire, the cemetery shadow, unknown age. A product of the mansion's fear and despair, he's not sure who to fear or what to despair of these days. Okay. All right. Oh, it's the professor. Hello? Luigi, can you hear me? Good to hear you're still okay. I lost your signal when that when that lightning struck. Hmm, that was some battle you had there. Why don't you come back on back to the lab? What? What? You think the lightning damaged the Poltergeist 3000? Don't worry about it. Even if that lightning had cooked your goose, your Poltergeist 3000 wouldn't even have a scratch. <laughs> Good job, Luigi. You made it back in one piece. We put it through the old ghost portrificationizer. Yeah. In we go. In go the ghosts. The ghosts are invisible. So we need to them into visible forms. And presto, turn them into beautiful ghost portraits. And done. Hmm. Well, we managed to turn these ghosts back into paintings. Thanks for your help, Luigi. Okay, so we got Mr. Lugs, the Floating Rolindas, Melody Penisima, Shivers, Spooky, and Bogmire. Got nine ghosts. Where would you go, Luigi?
Luigi. I want to show you guys something real quick before I end this off. I want to show you guys something real quick. It's where we fought Spooky. Yeah, I'll show you guys. I'll show you guys. Remember that flower I watered in the, in the area too? Well, it's grown. So my buddy Nathan actually told me that this flower will grow. The flower will. This flower will grow. Yeah, that's all I have to show you guys. So I'm gonna stop right. Yeah, so if you if you water this before Bogmire, after Bogmire, and after and after the third the third portrait boss, then you'll get something really cool. And but I won't show you it yet. So I'm gonna stop right here. And in the next episode, we're gonna explore area three. So thank you guys for watching this episode of my Luigi's Mansion Let's Plays. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, ring that bell icon, share on social media, yada, yada, yada. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Okay, bye!